So, hello and welcome back. Now, this video is a little bit different um, to what I'd normally do. Um, it's not involving Jaguar at all, would you believe? We're actually uh, in an Audi A5 right now. So this is my mum's car. Um, and what's happened is, um, there's a funky smell in here, okay? Oh, I mean funky, it smells like someone died in here, right? And it's coming from the aircon. Um, so I bought an aircon bomb. It's like a little can canister. You put it behind the seat, you press it, lets a load of, I don't know. But anyway, it all goes around the circulation. And it should theoretically kill the smell off. Uh, from your air conditioning. Um, now this hasn't worked. I've done two bombs and it's not really any better. So we've gone for a new alternative. So I'm going to try this. I've never done this before. So this is all new on me. I've gone for this. All right. So this is a Kilma Doctor. If that's how you say it, I don't know. But this is the one I've gone for. So this uh, apparently you spray it into the vents. So we're going to find out if this actually works and it kills the odour off. Because at the minute it smells literally like something's died in here. Um, it's not It's not nice at all. It smells like uh, an animal's crawled in your air vent and gone. You know, <laughs> gone off a little bit. So we're going to sort of see now uh, if this does the trick. So I have no idea how to do this. I haven't watched it on YouTube. All I know is that you spray it into the vents and foam comes out. So this could... This could go horribly wrong yet, <laughs> but we're going to find out. So according to the pictures, this looks uh, quite easy. Um, whether it is or not, I don't know. Uh, so, yeah, so if we're going to spray this in the vents... Um, I was better move Mum's uh, air freshener. I got all that for Christmas. That's quite cool, isn't it? Look at it. Yeah. So the vents are all on. The air's coming through. Because obviously if you're going to spray the foam down, you've got to make sure everything's open, I suppose. Um, and I know I have to remove the pollen filter, so I'm going to have to take that out. Even though it's, I put a new one in trying to get rid of this smell, I'm going to, have to take that out to spray this stuff in. So, um, yeah, let's, uh, let's get going. Turn on the air conditioner. All right, let's do this step by step before we really mess this up. Hang on. Um, so there's the air conditioner on. Uh, set the external circulation mode and temperature range to min. Oh, we're already on minimum. Uh, and we've got the external, because that's in, inside, isn't it? So, yeah, yeah, I'm, I think I'm right there. Um, so, switch off air conditioner and ventilation system. Eh? Right, so now it's telling me to turn it off. So, yeah, okay. I think I'm doing this right. <laughs> um, what's number two? Take off the dust and pollen filter. Well, we know where that is, so let me um, let me start doing that. On this car, the um, pollen filter, oh, bear with me, is located under here somewhere. Hang on. He's under here, so there's like a little tray thing. See, there's little, there's one, two, three. Yeah, it was just three. You unscrew these three. So let me do that and show you. So this piece of, it's like a foam stuff, yeah? So you've got to you don't break it when you remove it. And there's the three little things. We'll put them there so we don't lose them. Now, to get the pollen filter out. Oh, this is a bit awkward, bear with me. You like that. Ow. Um, and there you go. That's as easy as it comes out. So I have actually put a new one in this a few weeks ago to stop the smell. So it's a funny shape in this. Oh, there we go. Oh, come on. There you go. Right, so uh, let me just put those in the back as well. So we're on stage three now. Shake the can well before use. Apply the foam cleaner deeply with the probe in place of pollen filter or the place of condensation drain. Gradually dispense the foam cleaners to fill the whole conditioning system remove the foam excess coming out of the intake grill using a cloth after you use assemble the new pollen filter and wait 15 minutes oh so let's uh oh let's have a look then let's see what we can get out of here this this, <laughs> this is a very brave moment especially because this car's not mine um well, where's the pipe then there's supposed to be a pipe oh, there's nothing in there Oh, oh, hang on. Well, I've never seen that before. There you go, that's a new one on me. Oh, very nice. Um, hang on. 
be careful when you do this. I've just tried to screw this top on it, which just pushes on. Uh, I nearly covered myself in foam. Uh, <laughs> so be a bit careful when you're doing that. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to spray it into the uh, pollen filter housing sort of thing. Um, I don't know. Let, let, let's see how we get on. Oh, oh no. Forgot. I forgot to shake it. Oh no. Hang on. Oh, the tops fell off. Oh dear. Um, I'll come back to you. Well, that wasn't what I expected at all. Um, uh, there's foam everywhere. Um, yeah. yeah, this is a very interesting job, this, I have to be honest. Uh, I think that's now full um, of, of foam, so I'm now going to move on to the vents. <laughs> this, this I find a bit of a problem. It doesn't seem to clip on. Um, it's sort of like you press it on and it just is there. Look, look. Hang on, let's get it lined up because we've already had an accident once. But you think you'd press it like that and it would stop on, but it seems to clip on. But as soon as you move this, it comes off again. Bits, this is so scary. Oh, look, you can see it. Maybe for. <gasps> wow, now that is frightening. <laughs> well, um, <laughs> yeah, so um, it does smell nice, but look, it's all coming out the top. Um, so yeah, like I say, it does smell nice, but it's a bit, the, the, this, if this was on when you bought it and you just connected this white piece of pipe, I think it'd be a lot better. <laughs> so now I've got to do the other vent there and then what's left in the can. I'm just going to squirt some more in the... Look, it's slowly dis disappearing. You can hear it popping. Don't know if you can hear that, but I'm going to spray the rest of it in the pollen filter area. Um, and then we've got to leave it, I think. So let me just clean these two vents off and then we'll do that one. So um, what I'm doing, um, bear with me, let's just push the... It's a bit fiddly this, isn't it? Go down there. I don't know if this is right. It doesn't feel very, feel very good. Um, oh, now I can't get the pipe out. Oh dear. Let's not do that. Let's put the tops if that makes an improvement. Oh yeah, definite improvement. There we go. So let's push the pipe all the way in, like that. Can it go any more? No, that'll do. Right. Anything coming through? Not yet, I can't see any. Oh! Oh no! There we go. So, um, what's happened? Uh, well, as you can see, uh, the end came off as I was pressing it and it went all over everywhere. Um, <laughs> so, yeah. Oh, that's not very nice at all. So, Hmm. It smells nice and everything, but this can could do with some work. Um, yeah, but apart from that, it seems really good, to be fair. I mean, the smell is quite nice in it already. It smells nice and fresh. It, it did have a really funky smell in it, so, I mean, anything's better than what we got. But let me just uh, finish off. I've got another vent in the back of the car. I don't Hang on, bear with me. I'm just going to spray some in there as well, and then what's left is going to go into the uh, pollen filter sort of area. And then we've got to leave it, I think. Well, we'll go to the next instruction then. Well, I've definitely filled that up. Um, <laughs> so you can see the bubbles that are beginning to recede. Um, but yeah, that's, that's definitely uh, cleaned out. So now the whole car, I've filled every vent full of foam, right? So uh, what's the next stage? So this says wait 15 minutes. Oh, oh you've got to put the new pollen filter in and wait. Surely you wait for it to dry out and then put the pollen filter in. Don't know, but we're gonna we're gonna wait and put the pollen filter in. So 15 minutes. So the car's been left 15 minutes. Now I'm just gonna put the pollen filter back in. Um, literally just push it up, put that clip in, and then I'll screw it. But I probably won't video it because <laughs> I've got to lay in all of this. <laughs> so uh, yeah. So it's been 15 minutes. The, the pollen filter's in. The foam's done whatever it's done. 
Um, next stage is number four. Start the engine, turn on the air conditioner, set the internal circulation mode and temperature range to minimum. And turn the fan with min speed and increase it to maximum after 10 minutes. Right, so uh, bear with me. Put the seat back now. Oh, hang on, I've put the seat back right now. I can't reach the clutch pedal. I'm used to Jaguar, not Audi. It's on this side for some reason. Right, so that's on. Now what do we do? Um, <laughs> I think it said, turn it on. Lower setting. Fan on the lower setting. Oh. There we go. So then after 10 minutes, um, we're gonna put the fan on higher. No, I've read that wrong. So let's uh, increase the fan speed. You're supposed to do it, start off slow. Oh, I can hear the bubbles popping. Can you hear that? Oh. All the bubbles are coming out. Um, is this supposed to happen? <laughs> I don't know. I'm turning the heat up now, so maybe, maybe this is what gets rid of the rest of the bubbles. It blows all the bubbles, you know, it pops them all. I don't know. But they are disappearing quite quick, look. So you've got to leave it running for 10 minutes. Well, I didn't put it on full power because it's just going to blow it all out. Look. Oh, look, it's coming through here as well. Oh, now I'm turning that up again. Oh, oh, it's coming for everywhere. <laughs> Maybe we'll leave it on six and we'll turn it up in a minute. Just leave it on this one. Oh, let's uh, clean some of these bubbles off. It's like soap, that's what it feels like. Um, something's not coming out and spraying all at the windscreen. We're all right. It does smell nice in here though. I'll give it its due. Come on, can we do it yet? Oh my god. Oh! Oh! Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Um, so I've gone for full power. Um, feels like it's snowing in here at the minute, so now I've got to wipe everything down. Um, but I suppose it is getting it all now. So now we have to leave this for 10 minutes. So we get out the car because it's a bit overpowering. I think it's supposed to ventilate with this. Um, I may have forgot about that. Oh, here we go. I'm gonna have to go and get some more things to clean it with. Hang on. Oh no. <laughs> this is a very dirty job. I don't even have them doing this right, but it must be. So it's been 10 minutes. So it says stop the engine and set the parameters of the air conditioning and ventilation according to own preference. And then thoroughly ventilate the car. So what we're gonna do now, we turn the air con off, turn the fan down, and then now we're just going to switch it off and I'm going to leave mum with it. Oh, we can put the, uh, the Audi Lizard back. This is not a toy. Well, it kind of is, let's be honest. Um, yeah, mum had it on it, to be honest, just like that. Okay. So, um, yeah, this seems to have... Uh, oh, where is it? This seems to have taken away the uh, horrible smell in here. Actually, it smells quite nice, actually, to be fair to it. Uh, I'd recommend it. Yeah, I'd say this isn't a bad product, to be honest. Um, the straw that you put down is a bit naff, because uh, it was a bit kinked when I got it, and when, and when it's kinked, it all blew out the end instead. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I'd, I'd say it was alright. If you wanted to get rid of the smell of your aircon, um, or whatever the mouldy, horrible smell is, this this will do the trick for you. Um, but yeah, so that's it for this video. Um, Bit of a different one, but we thought we'd do something, uh, well, it's a bit awkward for me to do Jags at the minute because of the weather, uh, and plus I haven't got a lot to do to them at the minute. So anyway, and then my mum's car's got this funky smell. It was bad, yeah, it was nasty. Um, so yeah, it's done that. So thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and I'll see you all very soon with a new video.